Hey guys, it is a, a few days after Christmas and I haven't gotten any video up for like two days because Vlogmas for sure was really hard for me to get up a video every single day. So it's been I think two days since I've gotten my last video up and I was supposed to do a sit down video today. I was planning on doing a sit down video today. I want to do um, an update on Madison's autism. I'm always getting a ton of questions on Madison and her autism and her journey and where she is right now from when she was first diagnosed. And I keep on saying I'm going to film a sit down video, but I have not gotten a chance. So I was gonna do that today, but I've just had a horrible headache all day long. And plus I filmed two videos for Ryan's channel. And after filming those videos, I was just exhausted. And plus I had to do things around the house. So I thought I'd pick up the camera, maybe get a few clips of vlogs. I can get a video up for you guys sometime this week. Maybe I'll upload this tomorrow. Not sure, but this vlog will probably be kind of boring because I'm in the house. Um, it's already four o'clock or a little bit after four o'clock. I have to fold some laundry and um, edit one of Ryan's videos. And Ryan hit 100 subscribers. So exciting, right? Are you so excited? Woohoo! Yeah! Woohoo! And this is for you, Mom. Oh, you drew me a picture? Yeah. Ryan drew me a picture. It's sweet of you. So yeah, he hit 100 subscribers, which is so exciting. I'm pretty sure my five-year-old hit 100 subscribers before I did. I I think it took me like three months just to hit 100 subscribers. And he's been on YouTube for a month and he's already hit 100 subscribers. So that's exciting. So I wanted to do like a 100 subscriber yeah. thank you video. And I was planning on blowing up a bunch of balloons. I thought I had extra balloons, but I don't. So I'll probably have to go to the store and pick up some balloons, maybe tomorrow or something. But I did want to try out super fast. Um, I don't have lighting, but my husband said to try out one of his spotlights that he usually uses in the garage. Hold on. Um, so I want to try it out really fast just to see. Oh, well, that's bright. Hold on, Ryan. Just to see how it would be like if I do a sit down video. Here, move. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Blinded. Oh, whoa, that's super bright. All right, let's see. Hold on, put it down. Give me. All right. Oh my God. That is super bright. I don't know how I would do it. Here. No, leave it alone. I'm blind. I can't even see right now. I don't know. I'll have to figure it out because I need <laughs> yeah. some new lighting. I always want to record. And a lot of times it's like gloomy outside or raining or dark. And I don't have lighting and I can't afford lighting right now. So. Yeah. Does this look good, you guys? This is the lighting that he uses in his garage um, to work on his like car and stuff or if he has any projects to do. So this is how it looks. I'll show you guys. This is how it looks with the lighting. And can you turn it off for me, Ryan? So they can see how it looks with that lighting. So that's how it looks with the lighting. Can you turn it off for me? Turn the light off? Yeah, so they can see how it looks without the light. So, yeah, guys, I'm going to turn off the light from Molly's channel. Okay, he's going to turn it off just so I can see, like, the difference. Here, turn it off. And then that's how it looks without the lighting. So, yeah, that's a big difference. So, I'll probably use that for now until I can get some lighting of my own. Tell me when to turn it on. I don't need it on right now because I'm not going to do a sit-down video. I just wanted to see how bright it was. <laughs> You're cray-cray. So this is how the light looks that I'm probably going to be using from now on anytime I do like a sit down video or maybe the thing is I would have to figure out how to put it like if I do like cleaning videos and I need some lighting how I would set it up because obviously it's not like on a tripod stand I would have to like hang it from somewhere so that I would have to figure out but for sit down videos I can easily find like a chair to put it on but it's kind of dirty. It has like paint all over it because it was in the garage. But this is how the light looks like. I'm pretty sure he got this off of Amazon. So I will ask him the name because I don't see the name on it. I don't know. Maybe I'll find the name. But I don't see any name on it. So I will ask him where he got it. I'm pretty sure, like I said, it was Amazon. And once he tells me, then I will link it down below for you guys. Because you guys do YouTube videos too and you can't afford lighting. Sometimes you gotta get creative and you gotta use what's around your house. So I'll link this down below. And my kid is singing, We Wish You Merry Christmas. Christmas is over, buddy. I know. Tyler's tidings and bring wherever we go. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. You got, you still got chocolate on your chin, let me see. Yeah, we gotta go take a bath. 
he filmed two videos. Ryan filmed two videos for his channel. I'll insert a few clips of one of the videos we did. We tried to make pudding, but you guys, I didn't have regular milk, um, like whole milk. I never drink whole milk because I'm lactose and then Madison doesn't drink whole milk either. So yeah, I didn't have whole milk. So I had to use my almond milk that I had on hand, but I only had two cups of almond milk left and it called for three cups. So I had to use two cups of almond milk and one cup of soy milk for this pudding mix. So it was a little watery, it didn't thicken up. So I put it in the refrigerator and hopefully by tonight it'll thicken up. So it was kind of a fail, but he still enjoyed it. He said it tasted really good. So I'll insert a few of those clips as well into this vlog, as well as um, I have a few clips from Christmas when the kids, is someone coming to my front door? Um, when the kids open up their Christmas gifts. So I'm gonna insert that as well, just because like I said, I will be home. So I don't want this vlog to be too boring. So just to make it a little more interesting, I'll add those two clips. How are you enjoying the bath bomb? You like it? Yes. Yeah. It's black. Black, black, black. There's oh, a piece black. of the That's bath silly. bomb. Maddie. Here's the bath bomb. Oh Here's wow. what it looks like. All right, put I'm it back in. You're not supposed to touch it, put it back in. <laughs> Madison. She's flashy. Hey. Nope, she's gonna go. This is the bath bomb I gave the kids. It's by Crayola. This one's in very cherry scent. And it goes from red to yellow. Red and to then yellow. yellow to green, blue to purple, green to teal, maybe? Or no, it just turns two colors. Those are all the other colors. So this one's going to go from red to yellow. And then when those two colors mixes, it'll turn orange. I would show you guys in the bath, the kids so are in the bath. I would show you guys the bath bomb in the actual bath just because the kids are in it. And anytime they're in the bath, if I do vlog, I try to put the camera as low as possible so you guys aren't able to see them so they're not exposed. So I'm not going to film it. Maybe once they get out of the bathtub, I'll show you guys the end results of the color of how it turned out. But it is pretty late. Like the kids still haven't eaten dinner. It's six o'clock and we still haven't eaten dinner. I've just been doing things around the house. so. After they get out of the bath, I'm going to give them a quick dinner and then I'm going to fold some clothes. So I might film that when I fold some clothes. And then that's going to end the vlog for today. I know, boring. I picked up the camera maybe twice and all I did was talk to you guys. But it's just a typical day in my life. Um, Tomorrow is Friday, so I have a ton of errands to do. So maybe we'll vlog tomorrow just because we'll be out and about doing things. So it'll be a little more interesting. And then if I have time, I will try to film this down video, but I'm not sure if I'll be able to do that or not. But hopefully you guys are enjoying your Christmas break so far. I know we are, although we have been in the house all day today, but it's okay. But I'll pick up the camera in a little bit. It doesn't look very appealing, but that is how the water looks. It was like a reddish pink color after I just got the kids out. So. Yeah. What, what are you saying? Maddie, what are you saying? Are you nice and fresh and clean? Are you nice and fresh and clean? Hey! Come on, let's go to the room so we can get our pajamas on. Come on. This is what I look like out of the bath. Oh, Ryan's out of the bath. Wake me up! Wake me up, bro! Wake me up! 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 What happened to your hair, Bo? Your hair was just in a ponytail. Medicine loves her trampoline. This should probably be outside, but we have it inside for now. Do you like your little trampoline? You haven't been in it all day today. She played in it yesterday, but today I haven't put her in. So we're going to tire her out so she can go night-night super fast tonight. Bounce, bounce, bouncy, bounce, bounce, bounce. Yay! Is that so fun? I'll link down below the trampoline we got. We got this off of Amazon and it has been the best investment because it has like those little handles that go all the way around. So she's able to hold on and then it holds up to, I think a hundred or 150 pounds. So that's fun. Ryan can jump in it as well. We know it says only one person at a time, but they don't equal up to a hundred pounds. So. Your hair is crazy. What happened to your hair, Bo? Yeah. Bouncy, bounce, bounce, bounce. And this is how it looks. Hi. That's how it looks. We have it in our play area right now. Play area is a disaster. What? You wanna go on the trampoline? You are eating a cookie. You can't go in there with food. 
and you're on the phone with Olivia, so once you're off the phone with Olivia, then I'll let you in, okay? Okay. Bounce, bounce, bounce. She loves it. Now I can uh, go get some things and I'm going to start cooking for me and Robert. You can bounce too with no trampoline. That's amazing, buddy. I can jump higher than in the trampoline. Yeah. Sissy is having the time of her life in there. She, I don't know if this is a good idea or a bad idea, but hopefully it'll tire her out. It is currently 7 o'clock and I did not end up folding clothes. I had to fold Madison's clothes. But I did not do that, but that's okay. I'll just do it tomorrow. But I am going to start cooking dinner for me and Robert. The kids already ate dinner. They ate something different just because they usually go to bed like around 7.30, between 7.30 and 8 o'clock. Robert just got home from work now. So I'm going to start cooking dinner and I thought I would take you guys along with me and share with you what I'm going to cook tonight. I found this recipe off of Pinterest. I have cooked it before and both me and Robert really like it. So I'm going to cook it again tonight. And they're called shepherd pie bites so i'll show you guys how i make it and how it turns out i'll also leave the recipe down below just in case any of you guys are interested in making this recipe so i am going to now pour myself a glass of wine as well and start cooking all right so these are all the ingredients you will need to make the mini shepherd pie bites so you're going to need some pie crust any pie crust that you choose i'm just using this kroger brand it works just as well as like the pillsbury and then some mashed potatoes. I do usually like making mashed potatoes from scratch, but like I said, it's already 7.05 and I don't have time to make mashed potatoes from scratch, so I'm just gonna use these Bob Evan ones. Then I'm going to use some um, cheddar cheese and then some ground turkey. It called for ground um, meats, but I like turkey better, like ground beef, but I prefer turkey. So this is what I will be using. So today he's going to be making this Jello Play Dirt Dessert Kit. So it smells, okay. it smells good. It smells like a muffin. A muffin? Here, pour it all the way. All. Is it all out? Or this cup no. of milk inside? Can I pour it? Yeah, hold on. Be careful. Hold on. Okay. Got. Uh, we need to get one more. This is the way that you gotta mix it, guys. Blah, blah, blah. Uh oh, sissy, no, no, sissy. Sissy's trying to get everything. This, this That's how, how it looks so this far. How, this is how you gotta stir, guys. You gotta stir like that and splash. 
smash it around. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys, we're finished with it, but it was a complete fail, right? Yeah, so we use almond milk instead of regular milk, so it is still pretty liquidy, but Ryan still wants to pour it into the cup. So we're going to pour his in the cup and then put the rest in the refrigerator for the rest of the night, and then it should thicken up. So let's put your cup right here. So so I think I'm, I want to eat it like this because I'm so excited to try it. Okay. It's Oreo. Yeah. It's Oreo crushes. Oh, okay. Do it all the way around so it can look like dirt. And then now I'm gonna put a few. Now he's gonna put on these little gummies that are supposed to be like bugs. Ooh, this is gonna be yummy to eat. I said that they smell like gummy bears. Cool. What's next? A worm. He's gonna put on a blue worm. I'm gonna eat this gummy. I guess Ryan's just gonna eat all the bugs instead of putting it in his dirt. All right, put one more in. There we go. And this is how Ryan's dirt cup turned out. Mm, it tough, right. even though it's not thick. <laughs> how was it? Good? So I think Ryan says it's an A plus. Now he's gonna, ew, he's gonna eat a bug now. Mm. Yummy. Go with the bug in it too. Ah! No, thank you, Ryan. I'm dying. Another doggy? I'm going to do. Flip. I'm going to do. Yes. Yay. I got to flip a zoo. I want to open it. How about you open all your other gifts and then you can open that, okay? Okay. Madison, are you opening a gift? Oh, your hair is crazy. You got to fix your hair. I need a lizard, like. And it grows to be really big when you put him in the water. Whoa! So let me put him over there. Let me open this one before we open all of my toys. Whoa, bugs! What? The? I think you're gonna like that one. Ooh. I'm gonna Ooh. Open. No, I'm gonna okay. open this present. I'm gonna what? open this present, Mom. Oh, okay. you like it? It's a remote control. So you can stop feeling mommy and daddy's remote control. Oh, wow. Is that right? Oh. All right, guys. So it is now almost 10 p.m. So I'm about to jump in the shower, but I want to jump on here super fast to close out the vlog because you guys know I am queen of forgetting it to close out videos and vlogs. So just want to jump on here super fast and say thank you so much for watching today's vlog. If you clicked on today's video and watched all the way through, I am super grateful. So thank you so much for all of your support. As always, if you have not already, I would love for you to subscribe to my channel and join me and my YouTube family. And also turn on your notification bell so anytime I do upload a new video, you will be notified that I have uploaded. Thanks so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video.